What's up YouTube? Tench Arizona, the angry Dracolope of the Jackalope crew here. And I have a review for you today. Just excuse me while I switch hands. And it is a review, a long-term review in fact, of this. The SJ4000 action camera. But first, you'll have to watch the intro. So I will see you very soon. And I'm back. And as I said, today I'm going to be doing a review of this, the SJ4000 action camera. It records video at 1080p and takes 12 megapixel photos. As you can see, I've got my chest rig on and I'm gonna cut this now and go to some footage from this camera, minus the audio because I really do not like the microphone. Enjoy. Okay, so as you saw, the footage is actually pretty good with that little action camera. And I still have it on my chest rig at the moment, so let me take it off and I'll talk about it a bit more. Now, excuse me, I just clasped it again. Now, as I said, this is the SJ4000 action camera. Bit of a GoPro ripoff, to be honest. 1080p video and 12 megapixel photos. Now originally I was not going to buy this camera but I saw a video from a fellow YouTuber Chris Tanner of Prepared Mind 101 and I would like to thank him actually for pointing this camera out to me because if he didn't I would not have bought it. Now it's been a few years since he done that video I'm sure you can go back into his channel backlog and search for it and you will find it there. If not, it's probably been taken down. But anyway, thank you to Chris Tanner of Prepared Mind 101 for pointing this camera out to me. So, what do I think about it? Well, honestly, I've been using it for around two years. I've done footage in snow, in wind, rain, all sorts of weather conditions, and it's not really been affected. The case is good. This is still the original case. It does come with a spare back plate for the case. I've not used it. As I said, the audio when you're using it in the case isn't the greatest. That's one downside of this camera. But I generally shoot the audio for footage with this separately anyway. I generally wait until I get home and I'll do it on my editing software. But for the purposes I bought this for, which is to get out and record videos no matter what the weather is, this is a godsend. So, what do I rate it? Well, bearing in mind that it comes with a lot of accessories, not just this case. It doesn't come with the chest mount, that's from a completely different accessory set. Which, I'm not going to bother reviewing because it's a really cheap accessory kit, kit and the only thing I use out of it really is the chest mount. So, what am I going to rate this camera? Well, you've seen the footage, you know how I came by it. But, I have always said that my channel is going to be nothing but honest reviews. I don't let anything colour my biases. So, let me tell you what the pros are of this camera. Now, the pros, obviously price, availability, it is readily available. Footage quality and picture quality, although, let's face it, 12 megapixels is not that great anymore. There are cell phones that do far better, including the one I am using right now, the Huawei P20 Pro. But for what I bought it for, it is five stars. However, I have to take into account that the microphone on this camera absolutely sucks. 
and for that fact alone I am knocking a star off four stars accessories five stars price five stars functionality aside from the microphone four stars that's why it gets a dip there availability of accessories it will take most GoPro accessories so again five stars and memory it can take up to a 128 gigabyte SD card now it does advertise that it can only take up to a 64 that's not been my experience I only use a 128 gig Samsung SD card in here works flawlessly so overall score for this camera is four and a half stars because it only got a poor poor microphone only one rating got four stars so four and a half star rating overall a bit of an unusual rating for me but there you go again thank you chris tanner of prepare mind 101 for helping me find this camera i have had excellent use with it for the past couple of years and yes i've got a god ray in my video i'm not gonna do anything with that because i actually like how it looks anyway that's my review on the sj4000 if you like it like it please subscribe comment and share and remember be good to each other